Today we're going to demonstrate elastic and totally inelastic collisions. I have two carts and a track. The carts both weigh the same amount. Their masses are the same. And uh, they have magnets here that oppose each other. So there's a magnetic force. And um, so what I'm going to do is, is leave one stationary and then push the other at a slow speed and see what happens after the collision. So what you can see is that this one that started off moving collided, didn't actually hit it, but the magnetic fields interacted for a very short period of time and transferred all of its energy to the other cart. And we can do the same thing in reverse. It transfers all of its energy to the other one. That's a, that's a an e, so-called elastic collision where there's no energy lost in the collision. Uh, during the collision, both energy and momentum are conserved. And the, when you solve the energy conservation equations and the momentum conservation equations, you find that all of the energy must be transferred from the one to the other. Uh, the other way you can do this is in the frame of reference of the center of mass of these two uh, carts. And if I'm capable of uh, pushing them both at approximately the same speed, um, then they'll hit and, and leave each other at the same speed that they came together. These uh, carts are, are different. They have no magnets, but they have some Velcro here and here on both of them that allows them to stick together. So you start with this one stationary and this one moving. Then once they hit, then they move along together at a slower speed than what then this one was moving originally. This one has zero energy initially. This one has energy one half mv squared. Once they hit, they move along as a unit with twice the mass and a smaller velocity that you can calculate from uh, conservation of energy. You can also do this one in the center of mass frame. Um, and if you impart the same momentum to this one, equal and opposite momenta to these two, then you can get them to stick and uh, remain stationary. Just like that. That's uh, a totally inelastic or perfectly inelastic collision.